Hey, hey, I'm Zansi. Now, I'm Zansi, while money can purchase you a very expensive Mercedes Benz to cry in, it may not, however, buy you love. Now, after Sami Zimshongo tried his luck to maintain Mohale Motaung, who's 20 years younger than him, the young boy lastly noticed the sunshine after cashing in big time and is leaving without trying again. Hello and welcome to Entertainment News in Zansi. Now, if you're new to my channel, you know you're here for the story, go ahead, click the subscribe button and the bell, and you'll never miss an update. So this 26-year-old allegedly uh, vacated his matrimonial house in Danefern, northern Johannesburg, sometime around November last year. And now sources have confirmed that Mohale's authorized workforce has served the idol as a judge with divorce papers. Now, it was only a year in the past when Samizi determined to take the younger man to his house and live with him. To many, it got here as a shock, as once they checked out Mohale at that moment, he was younger and harmless and was extra befitting to be Sumizi's son-in-law. But then love blinded the idols as a judge and he sponsored his husband and helped him rise to fame. As I speak to you right now, Mohale has now over 1 million followers and is at the moment having fun with his bachelorhood within the mom metropolis. Now this uh, young man since eliminated his marriage ceremony ring, where else Sumizi nonetheless went Wears it for only comfort. According to Shut Shut Pals of the couple, Somgaga has been paying his husband since late last year simply to allow them to fake to be completely satisfied within the eyes of the general public. Now, Somizi's true friends are by his side as always. He's quiet while, on the other hand, Mohale is living the life of a happy bachelor in Cape Town. Somizi went into the marriage with his heart entirely open and he's always wanted the best for both of them, mentioned the supplier of the news. Now, you'd know that uh, the supposed marriage crumbled even earlier than the two may admit but Sumizi did attempt to be specific to his anger blaming it on cell phones saying that it's the cell phones that are actually causing a drift in their relationship. Sumgaga did mention he genuinely wished he could actually be touched just as much as the cell phone. It's not even about me feeling neglected. I find it also to be too self-serving. If you're not on Instagram or Twitter or Facebook you are taking pictures, you are taking selfies. I feel like yo sometimes I wish to be touched like that cell phone. Now that you have it, Zansi, this tea just came in now and I am hoping it's not true because I really, really love Somhale and I was praying that they just get over whatever it is that they're going through. Zansi, there you have it. Do leave your thoughts in the comments section below. I love to hear from you. But for now, you know, I will bring you the updates hot just the way you like it.